God is using Prophet Antoine Jasmine all over the world to bring healing, deliverance, and transformation to every race, color, and creed. Witness the testimonies of individuals who are affected by the power of the prophetic. I'm glad to have you today. The Lord's hand is upon you, sir. I speak that every opportunity that God has for you will be released to you. There is an occupation, a job situation that you're seeking. There's a living situation that need to change. There's transportation situations that need to change. God's about to bless you, but you're going to have to make some power kingdom moves. I'm so happy the Lord allowed what was in your past. I'm so happy that what God allowed, did not allow to take you out. Daughter of God, whose God hand is upon you're called as the woman of God is praying with her husband over there. You said she's praying with her husband over there. I mean, I see that grace on you and your husband because the Lord wants to raise you up to be a mighty intercessor. As we spoke to others earlier concerning intercessory prayer, you, you will be a gap stander for your family. Now, I don't know when the anniversary is, but I, I hear the word renewal of vows. You can renew those vows. It's been a year, but something's going to be renewed in the second year. Y'all not say nothing. Just give God praise. I don't like the married folk because it don't make sense. I got too many pastors to do it. But I'll renew your vows. I'll lay hands on you. And I'll command the curses that were spoken on your day you got married. Y'all not say nothing. All the hell you went through on your wedding day. It don't make sense. On the wedding day they went through hell. I've never talked to this couple. But the Lord says it was hell. It was hell. It was, it was like a great and terrible day. It was great and terrible at the same time. But as God's prophet, I declare I'm the man sent by God to renew the vows and to break off every curse that's been spoken against your marriage that will cause money to enter your hands again. My God, I give you praise. I know, respectfully, I say this. You have forgiven your husband of some things. You've left some things. It's amazing this woman is still with you because she's been assigned to you. No, God created her for you. No other woman would deal with you and bear the load the way this woman has bared the load with you. Because of that, God does not hold your sins against you. Because as I'm looking at you, there is a blood, a bucket of the blood of Jesus going into you. The bloodline of the men in your family. That God have closed prison doors for you. God have shut down the enemy. And God is going to open doors no man can open. Come on, if God before you, who could be against you? I hear the Lord say, you owe God. You owe God. You owe God. My God. It should have been over for you. You owe God a yes. The answer to your prayer is yes. We respond yes. Come on, we respond, yes. Come on, should I stay with him? The answer is yes. Come on, my God, I bless you. Come on, when is it going to happen? Come on, right now. An inherited blessing, we declare it to be so in Jesus' name. Give God a hand praise. You prophesied to, to us about our marriage, our living arrangements, and our wedding, how it was a good day, but people really wasn't happy for us. We were happy, but... Some people that were sitting watching wasn't happy for us. Like, you know, they didn't want to, they don't want to see us happy together. Everything he said from the first word to the last was very, very accurate. Yeah, it was ac just about, um, I don't need friends, you know. Everybody not for you. And about, you know, job opportunity. Things gonna happen and stuff. Telling you from the first word to the last word, 100% accurate.